good evening, I thought you guys could do with an evening reading. <laughs> I thought you guys could do with an evening reading. It sounds so demanding, doesn't it? <laughs> well, I thought it would be fun to do a little evening reading. The week ahead reading was quite <laughs> long, as always. But I think it was extra long. But nonetheless, interesting. I think today we might just use two... <laughs> oracles? <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> Questioning myself. It's because that... Oh, it's right there. Well, that makes sense then. There was a... Oracle popping up in my mind. One, one, one. I don't know why I put it on this finger. The secret language of light. But I also want to use this. One of the white roses was hanging a little bit, so I took it and I did the rose ritual. And I remembered when I had picked off the flowers or the petals or whatever you call it that I did a reading not long ago when it comes to or when it came to roses right or something I spoke about the rose ritual but I went outside I put them up in the air I danced around while they were falling on me that was very nice <laughs> do that if you wanna oh, two 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 <laughs> if you wanna bring in the light and the love and the creativity and everything <laughs> okay i'm all concentrated <laughs> so let's start out with this because i can i can always take more of this oracle so this is just a little evening something a little evening shenanigans with you and me <laughs> How are you guys doing with like the shift what's going on right now? Can you feel it? Can you not feel it? No matter what's happening in your life, remember that the light is coming back. Especially with the secret language of light. I don't know why I heard someone say toss a coin. And instantly three three three. Wow! Whoa! Damn! I have actually seen 444 quite a lot these past days. Anyway, um, <laughs> lost what I was about to say again. The toss a coin, it reminded me of um, The Witcher. Um, like the song, right? Toss a coin to you, Witcher. I want to watch that again. Meditation, we actually did get something about that. I think a lot of you guys, you are, like, if you feel like you're struggling at the moment, it's because that something is shifting in your life. Shifting in your life. And that might be something that's hard to... Well, it could be that something is hard to let go of. In a way, and there's a sadness with a chapter ending, or it can be an old job, it can be a colleague moving away, a friend moving away, it can be a breakup, it can be whatever, right? But there could be something, but it actually leads to something new, in a way. Like, it's there's an upgrade happening in your life, even if you feel stressed. So, what is it that you need to know that? A lot of unexpected things are happening at the moment, all of us, and you need to flow in it. Ask your soul. Hmm. Interesting. I don't think we have gotten this card before. Ask your soul. 16. Ask your soul. What does the soul say? <laughs> that is wrong. What does the fox say? <laughs> Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> That's not what my soul is saying. That's what. <laughs> hmm. 
<laughs> that was a fox say. <laughs> what does the fox actually say? Did you guys see the vlog <laughs> with Megan? <laughs> Did you see the orbs, people? Tell me that that is not magnificent. <laughs> he is a magnificent creature. Hmm. Allow yourself to dream about the kind of life you desire and then write down your dream. Maybe there's something about writing or meditating on what your dream is. I feel it was actually a part of the week ahead energy, like really tapping into it, right? Allowing yourself to really expand in your life. Yeah, that means that some things need to be let go of in a way to make space for new, to bring in the new or to heal something. Asking is the first step in your, or in any creation, which is true, asking. Maybe you do feel like you ask a lot of questions. It's, it's interesting because not long ago we did have this like why card. I think it was on was it? No, it was really that was posted on the first of November, I believe, actually, right? Where the card like why it was reversed. So maybe there is something where you're still not understanding why something is happening or why something happened. Why? <laughs> why? It can be a like why. But it can also be a like, why? <laughs> it can be a good why. It can be, I mean, it, I guess it depends on <laughs> your journey, right? It can, well, if something good is happening in your life and you're stressing about it, it's like, why do you stress about it? Why do you worry? Why do you fear? Why can come from many whys. <laughs> well, if we don't see any evidence our desires are coming into existence. We keep asking, isn't that the truth? Isn't that the truth? Spirit is like, stop asking and act. Feel. Allow. Let it effing unfold. <laughs> it's like, human, we got a plan. Why the hell are you stressing so much? <laughs> it's like, yeah. This holds us in a place where the answers can be heard. <laughs> I think some of you guys have been asking way too many questions lately. <laughs> what you desire is on its way. There you go. I just told you, right? What you desire is actually on its way. So, what does that mean? I will allow you a good hard think. Good I think. What does that mean? What is your desire? Your desire can be many things. Ten cent. Wow. What does it mean? It means that it's on its way. You only need to ask once. <laughs> we know. We got it. We understand. And obviously, it doesn't matter if you ask this in your mind or if you ask it out loud because the universe acts out of vibration so well that was a <clears throat> beautiful card now we're gonna take this so with that 11 11 <laughs> holy cannoli boli <laughs> the 11s have <laughs> come up quite a lot <laughs> you know Not make it up. <laughs> you cannot make it up, people. <laughs> one one. <laughs> Do you see what I see? Courage and new beginnings. Energy and circles. I mean, hello. <laughs> I know my spirit guys are just laughing. Whoa, laughing their asses off. <laughs> one. <laughs> one 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 one. <laughs> True love <laughs> and happy success. Whoa. I mean, I, <laughs> I hear you, <laughs> I see you, <laughs> spirit, I know. <laughs> New supportive connections. A lot of you guys are going to experience 12-12. You're going to experience um, <clears throat> a lot of new people coming into your life. Kindred. Kindred. Kindred? partnerships so if it's in love or if it's a business a friendship it, it's all happening it's all freaking happening let me just show you these cards again one 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 
first card, courage. So you need courage for these new beginnings because you also need to allow yourself to let go of the worry and the fear and the blah, blah, blah. The, like, what if this was true? What if this doesn't work? What if I'm not good enough? What if this happens? What if that happens? What if I'm getting fired? What if I'm blah, 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 blah. It's over, you're over, 13, 13. Stop with the numbers. <laughs> <clears throat> you're overstimulating your your whys, your mind. Something is happening if it's in career, just in general with new connections, new people coming into your life. That is something I have really like again opening up Sandra allows new people to step into your life that vibrates on your effing energy. I did not know that this was a thing. <laughs> I didn't know it existed. I kind of gave up hope <laughs> that there was people like me <laughs> besides Kiri and my neighbor <laughs> and whoever else I have. But that's like people that I've known for a while, right? But new people, I was like, I don't think we exist. <laughs> and then one thing <laughs> leads to another and there's a bunch of magical people in my life that is kind of overwhelming. <laughs> no, it's not overwhelming. It's is overstimulating my senses because that I'm allowing myself not to ask why. Why? What is the what is the catch? <laughs> you know? Do I need to sell my soul now or something? <laughs> what is it? You know, I was like, actually, you manifested this girl for the past sixteen years. You guys know, <laughs> especially if you're a cardinal sign, we are stepping into a new era. <laughs> Okay, we deserve this. <laughs> you all are stepping into a new era. Just saying. The past 16 years has been tough on us. It has been lessons over lessons over lessons. But look where we are now. So you better believe what the universe is bringing into your life. That's it, people. 15 15. <laughs> <laughs> Can we handle more awesomeness? <clears throat> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh! I felt something. What was that? It was my bracing going down. <laughs> I'm gonna cut this reading before something else happens. <laughs> Thank you guys for being here. I love you guys. I'm gonna see if I can go live soon because like, I know you guys missed that. And I don't think me... Well, was it in October me and Kiri went live? 555? Or was it last month? I can't remember. Anyway, we will be live soon. Bye! 16! That is 16. Have a great something. <laughs> Love you all. Bye! 16, 16! <laughs> wow! <laughs>